Happy Friday! It is the first day of our vacation and I am so excited but yet I'm not excited for vacation yet because we're dealing with this. Yes, you see some bags there. Mind you, we're only going away on vacation to Puerto Rico for about three days. So why do I have three bags and what is this? Plastic bag, Listerine. No, we're not taking that with us. What happened here? Our bed is all apart. My desk has been taken apart. Hey, it's me, hi. Bed empty. More bags. More bags. Half empty cupboards? Even more empty cupboards. So what is happening is that we're actually getting fumigated. They're tenting our building and they're starting the day that we come back from our vacation. So we can't be here, the pets can't be here. We had to even take our plant outside because it would die if it was in here when they fumigated. And it's just a lot that we've had to prep. I mean, we've had lists going for days of the things that we have to do and get ready and it's very kind of overwhelming to know that you're going to go on vacation and you're not going to be able to come back home. So we're trying to do as much as we can, but we've both been really stressed and poor Nick is taking his personal training certification test this morning and he just left, it's like 10 o'clock now, um, and he just left to go to that test. So he's basically not coming home until a week from now and like I said we're only gonna be on vacation for three days so we're staying with my parents they've been kind enough to put us up and also watch the dog we also had to organize my cat poor kitty she got separated from us and the dog she's actually staying with a co-worker of mine who's kind enough to take her in for the like about five six days so it's just a lot this is how we're starting our vacation though so we're just gonna have to get excited. I'm just happy that the packing is almost done. I just have to empty the fridge and the freezer and I think that's it for right now. And then I'm heading to my parents. Whew. For those of you who are curious what happens when you get fumigated and what you have to do, I figured I'd save my last bag for you. So you have to put your stuff in these plastic bags and the fumigating company gives them to you and you have to put your anything that you might ingest so prescriptions mouthwash food anything that's not factory sealed which is why we have empty cupboards you have to put inside like you have to double bag they give you these bags and then they give you zip ties and you zip tie the inside bag really tight and then you fold that in and then you have to tie the outside bag and then there's your final product double bags these are tough to tie too they're like kind of thick you're on vacation and you passed your personal certification exam today, sir. How are you feeling? Yeah, I already got one mojito in me. It's <laughs> one of many. How are you feeling, though? Yeah, well, good. <laughs> How else can you feel? It's a big day. It's a big Friday. We got to, we don't have to go back to work for more than 48 hours, so <laughs> I'm happy. It's good stuff. Yeah. We did start the vacation off with some mojitos and they were they're pretty good but um, they were much needed <laughs> so now we're just gonna make our way to our plane and looking forward to landing and getting situated in Puerto Rico and if you find yourself in the JetBlue terminal at Tampa International don't be afraid of a giant iguana it's kind of like a landmark here We made it! Woo! That's some excitement right there. 
We can give Checking you out the booze list. Nice. Give you a quick tour of our hotel. As you can see, we are staying at the Intercontinental San Juan. When you come in, you've got this little, ooh, bright little bathroom. It's not bad. It's a little bit small, but we've got a tub and a nice shower and everything. And you can see I already unloaded a bunch of my stuff. You can have our own little coffee machine and we've got a fridge. And then come in the room. Nice big king size bed and nice little sitting area. I don't know if we'll be able to see the view. Well, you can kind of see it. We have what they call the Laguna view, which is apparently street lights. No beach view, but it's really pretty at night, so I'm okay with that. And it is about 8.30 right now, so we're both starving. And we're gonna go get some dinner. Do it. Yes. Go get some food, and then we're probably gonna crash because we're exhausted. So here's to tomorrow mm -hmm. for the like start start of our our time here in San well we're like right outside San Juan so we'll be in around San Juan and around Puerto Rico. Say good night. Night.